All right, so in this problem, we want to find the value of our unknown variable, and in this case, it's going to be a. Now we're given an expression for a, and we are also given the values of the variables b and h. So let's plug those into the expression for a and solve. So we have a equals half times b, which is 19, times h, which is 12. All right, so now we have to simplify and solve. So we have this half and we can multiply it by an even number so it divides equally or it multiplies equally. So we can switch the numbers around using the um, commutative property of multiplication. So we have half times 12 times 19. So now a half times 12 gives us six times 19, which all this equals a. Now if you don't know what 6 times 19 is, we can break up this 19 into 10 and 9 and multiply the 6 into both of the numbers and add. So we have 6 times 10 and we have 6 times 9. So 6 times 10 gives us 60 and 6 times 9 gives us 54. And now when we add these two numbers, we get 111, which is the multiplication of 6 times 19, which is also the value of A, which is going to be answer B in this problem.